Alright, so, by now, uh, people who watch my channel probably knows what this game is. It's my little testing grounds, uh, to test characters, er, and enemies. Uh, um, I'm gonna do a new update today, actually, guys. Today there will be a new update. I added this guy's clock, so if you, so I'll delete it if you want to. This is supposed to be a reference to FNAF because of course there's a dead spring trap. Spring trap never dies. Oh, there's the enemy, and this guy is creepy. Guess you should go meet Yvraj. Hey Yvraj, and he KO'd us. And these guys are creepy. As you can see, they're supposed to stay in their enclosures, but they don't. Um, however, um, for the next update, for chapter 4, uh, I'm, uh, helping, no, my friend's helping me make the game. I'll probably pay him in Robux when I'm done. We're gonna add the little cave monster guy here. Uh, he already made this not that long ago before the game, uh, started. So, so chapter 4 will include this guy and this guy. He's already in chapter 3 as a little reference, and this guy's in chapter 3. But there will be more of these guys in chapter 4. In this game, the testing grounds, I will also actually be having lore. Yes, guys. Uh, I'm, this is the place where I can test out lore and stuff. Um... Alright. Mm okay, time to make the new updates. This game will update every time we have a new character that is in, in need of testing. This time it's a new enemy. Um, they can vary from uh, characters to enemies um, to... Even, uh, to even NPCs, character, they fall into characters, uh, so let me just turn that around, and then, you know what, I'll do that actually, and then, I'm actually gonna scale it, there we go. And then I'm just gonna go a little bit past there. We're gonna make sure it cover. Nope. Stay right there. And then we're gonna make sure it covers the whole little thing. And then to end that off, we're gonna add a little wall right here. Um. Every single update, uh, we will be adding new characters, like always. Uh, so if you guys want to see. Or test out the new characters before they actually release in the actual game. Um, well, now's your time to do so because Chapter Four is gonna release in a week or two from now, and Chapter Four is gonna be pretty big for lore, I think, and it's also gonna be pretty big for the game standards. My friend, uh, Exe, or yeah. He's gonna make some character. I mean, he's gonna make some uh, people for the game. And, uh, no, I don't think I actually. Yeah, I guess we could add Cave Monster. I guess we could test out Cave Monster in this. In this game. I use this for the, uh, testing grounds. A Ronin Demise has not been here for that long, and it's already a fun game to play. I think you guys should try it out. Really, guys. It may not be the best horror game, but I know it's pretty fun. My opinion, of course, but... I think you guys should try it out. It's a new breath of fresh air from very scary horror games. <laughs> I 
this is the little testing grounds place. Um, you know, here's something good though. I'm gonna definitely remove Spring Trap and replace him with a new character. You'll know. Um, now before a new update comes to the game, I'm gonna put a coming soon sign. Uh, for the game, and may, and then if you do see the coming soon sign, that means the next day or two days after, we're gonna probably have a new update. I don't know. Well, if you like it, but uh, all right, cave. Uh, we know th the canonical name is came cave monster. It's just cave monster. Uh, cave monster killer test. But yeah, um, when we finally, uh, yeah, when we finally finish the whole game and stuff, a boxy escape. Ooh, I think we should test out the new character, Cave Monster. Ooh, we oof shoot in one hit. All right, that's good. That's a true horror game. Oh, that's good, guys. That is good. At least you get to test out the jump scares and stuff. Get ready for those. But now we're gonna actually use. I mean, we're gonna actually use this sign. Because I'm actually gonna place this down here because we're gonna have some more characters soon. I'm just gonna place that down there and then. Before the next update, I'm just gonna remove that and then, yeah, make it in the new update. Now, Spring, this is another new character. His name is Bloxy. And if, oh, uh, this was actually one of the new, uh, one of the older people that was here in December, I think, I don't remember, or January, early January. We had a game, uh, yeah, December, early January. I had a game, I made a game called A Bloxy Escape. That's cancelled. For now, at least. <laughs> um. And I made a block, a block word called Bloxy. I named it Bloxy. Now, uh, my friend, I, I commissioned him to make a model of Bloxy here. 2D model. And now, Bloxy right here is gonna replace Springtrap. Bye! Finally, I brought the fresh air. Bloxy. Oh. And every time there's a new update, Bloxy will change uh, his text. For this update, he's gonna say, make sure you visit our new cave monster enclosure, enclosure. Thank you in advance. Oh shoot, I did something wrong here. Alright. There we go, there is Bloxy, he's saying hi! These are actual legit real characters for our game. And I guess we could probably say what they're based on. I don't know where the, uh, my friend came in with the idea for this guy, the cave monster. Uh, Slen Slenemy? Uh, I know. Uh, he's based 
uh, off a Slender Man, and he's an enemy. And then, finally, Yvraj. He is my friend's name who made the models, of course. And, uh, I wanted to make a scary little zombie, and I didn't want to use the actual version of, uh, they don't want to use the actual zombie Roblox made because it is so slow, and I don't know how to code and stuff, so he just coded everything for me. Thank you, friend. Um, but yeah. I guess, uh, that is our update for now, and then maybe soon we'll have a new update, and then, yeah, um, our testing grounds are getting bigger and bigger uh, by the week. <laughs> yeah, guys, make sure to check it out. Link in desk.